Hello, everybody. Welcome back into another video. My name is Sin, and it is time for the long-awaited Uncharted 4 playthrough. I have played one through three for the first time on this channel. I finally understand Nathan Drake's story, and I'm ready to jump into four and then Lost Legacy, and I'm very excited. I did not think I would enjoy Uncharted as much as I have enjoyed Uncharted. I think that the games progressively just got better and I love the entire cast of characters, Nathan, Elena, Sully, Chloe, Charlie. There, I'm sure there's more, but everyone was so fun to get to know. The stories were fun and I just really ended up enjoying and loving Nathan's character. So I am very excited, but also a little bit sad to have made it to Uncharted 4, which from my understanding is Nathan Drake's last game. I know that Lost Legacy exists, but the only character that I really saw was Chloe. So I assume that's her game and Nathan isn't really a part of that. So I am a little sad to have made it this far because this is the conclusion of Nathan Drake's story, but I know it's going to be a really good time. So without further ado, let us jump into Uncharted 4 A Thief's End. All right, subtitles are on, audio has been adjusted, we are ready to rumble. I am a man of fortune and I must seek my fortune. Henry Avery, 1694. Uncharted 4 before oh, I play through 1 through 3 and then I really oh I'm supposed to be heading that way my bad my bad there's an island and then I realized that I was missing a lot of the story and a lot of the attachments by having not played the earlier games so that is why I went back and I played um, 1 through 3 and in Uncharted 4 I only made it to Italy and seeing Nathan He's older, you know? He's got the worry lines on his forehead. He's got the crow's feet around his eyes. It's it's so different from like the young Nathan Drake that was in um, one through three, you know? I should have been doing that anyway. Oh man. So yeah, seeing Nathan again has got me tearing up. Oh, oh God, oh God, okay. There's so many people in front of me right now, Sam. Oh, no. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's not okay. That one was about to land on top of me. It's not okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. I need to get in front of him. Oh, okay. Okay. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Oh, oh, my bad, my bad, I wasn't paying attention. Go, Nathan, go! Okay, let's try this again. Where's Sam? Nathan! Hey! I'm okay! I'm okay! Shit, the engine's out! What? I can, I can fix it! Just, just cover me! <laughs> Damn it! Come on! Okay. Come on! Once again, no health bar. Oh, really? Really? Still alive? Holy shit! Tom is a bitch! Damn it! More common! Okay. 
Hold, I'll be right with you. Stick your head out. There we go. Okay, is it? No, okay. Am I driving still? I'm driving still. Let's go. Uh, okay, I see them. Oh, oh god. Oh. I, I'm doing great, Sam. Just shut up for a second. Nathan, hurry! Just hang on! <laughs> this boat only goes so fast. Got it. I've got it. Oh, oh never mind. I do not have that. That was outside of my control. <laughs> oh, man, that first Nathan. sequence hits so hard. But, like, you have to see it from the beginning, and now I understand. Nathan. What are we gonna do with you? You must be tired of these lectures. I know I'm tired of giving them. Mm. And now you have to stay here with me all weekend instead of going on the retreat with everyone else? I don't care. Yes, that is the crux of the problem. I don't see why I'm the only one being punished. Because you started the fight. You wouldn't give me back my book. I told you to leave those books in your room. You only have yourself to blame. Doesn't give him the right to just snatch it from me. Does that give you the right to start throwing punches? I don't know. Nathan, did you win? It wasn't just about the book. What was it then? Nothing. I'll save it for confession. <laughs> I forgot he grew up Catholic. No matter what I try, you seem insistent on going down the same sad road as your brother. That's not fair. What a waste. Yeah, that's really not fair to say to a kid. How long was this before he ended up in South America and meeting Sully? I'm trying to get, like, his timeline right in my head. There's still so much about Nathan that I feel like I'm missing. Because I know in the third game, they say that Dr Nathan Drake is not his actual name. But I don't know what his real name is, and I also don't know what happened to his parents. So... I feel like I didn't do a great job of explaining this in the very beginning. So, once again... I tried starting Uncharted 4 before playing 1 through 3 just because a couple people told me that I could do that and like still enjoy the story but then I made it to the Italy portion right in the beginning and I was like I'm missing an attachment to this character so I went back earlier this year and I started playing 1 through 3 and it has been amazing and Seeing Nathan in that beginning scene that we just went through, once again with the worry lines and the age lines and the crow's feet, it hits. I see you. It hits very hard. So I can't imagine what it must have been like for people that we go. really grew up with Whoa. the Uncharted... Sorry, Nathan. Too slippery. Uh, really grew up with the Uncharted saga and really being able to see that progression of age on Nathan... But also, um, way before starting Uncharted 4, I knew that Nathan had a brother because when this game first released years ago, that was the big thing everyone was talking about. Oh, Nathan has a brother that's never talked about in 1 through 3. So I knew that tidbit, but the rest of this game is still a mystery to me. So I am looking forward to seeing how this is the conclusion to Nathan's story and what exactly is um, going to be happening and what role his brother plays is a big one for me. Crap. Oh, not this way. Oh, 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 oh. Outside? This way? Gotcha, this way.
Isn't it our job to help Good. boys like him? In the meantime, I'm neglecting the other dozen boys under my care. <sighs> what do you want me to do? You know my opinion. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up on him yet. You can't keep avoiding it. <sighs> Look, I'll talk to him in the morning. Okay? Collectibles? Anywhere? Good night, Father. Good night, Sister Catherine. Okay. Got it. <laughs> Gotta get to that window. I've got you, Nathan. Come on. Move it, sister. When it's safe, roll out. Okay, come on, finish your cigarette. Sister Catherine? Oh, darn. <laughs> oh, Sister Catherine, I've forgotten my keys again. Can you open the gate for me? Coming, Father. We're good. Come on. <clears throat> now I've got you, kiddo. So, yeah, um... <clears throat> I, I would be very grateful if someone could explain the timeline of this to me. Um, so how soon is this before Nathan ends up meeting Sully? Because he met Sully at a very young age, which also made me question how he got to South America alone. But maybe that's a question for another time. <laughs> I am once again gonna have to get used to the fact that everything Sam? breaks under Nathan everything he will never be safe oh you gotta learn to watch your back <laughs> all right hey, it's good to see you little brother what was that really again it's nothing you told me you'd stay out of trouble though he was talking shit about us so he said that Dad dumped us here because we're worthless, and Mom is in hell because- Nathan, Nathan, come on. They're just saying it because it gets to you, all right? You just gotta learn to laugh it off. You wouldn't. Okay, so his, their dad say, left. Not as I do. Yeah. You'll catch a cold. Mm. So, what are you doing here like this anyway? If the nuns catch you, they're gonna call the cops. Well, I got something for you, and I couldn't wait till Christmas. What? It's outside. What happened to us staying out of trouble? Uh, this is an exception. Mm hmm <laughs> Nice jump. You'll get there Come one on. day, yeah. Nathan. Give me a hand. With all the jumping you could ever ask for. <sighs> so much jumping. Shit, you right. The sister's feeding you enough. <sighs> the place is kind of empty. Where is everyone? Some Bible retreat. Yeesh. I remember those. And I know the games came out in different generations, but also now I'm just really appreciative of how far the graphics and character designs have come. How's Father Duffy doing? He's the one decent guy in there. You should come and say hi. Nah, I don't need the guilt. <laughs> Good old Catholic guilt. This way. We're getting there. I also that love easy. that now I kind of understand that Nathan probably gets his love of climbing from his brother. I don't know if it's a love of climbing as much as like a necessity to be climbing. Damn. You didn't prop it. I, I, I did. At least I thought I did. 
No, it doesn't matter. We're gonna take the high road. The high Scenic road. route. Just follow me. Watch this. Whoa. And now we take the high road. I wish I had had a grapple in the earlier games. Have you done this before? Uh, once or twice. Yeah, come on. Your turn. On it. Oh, hold, hold, hold. There we go. So, what you been up to? Working mostly. Are you still dating that girl? Oh, uh, Crystal? Uh, on again, off again. Currently, off again. Nice. Okay. No guts. No glory. You're fine. Look at how pretty everything is. Okay. I love gothic architecture. On, I'm coming. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Just don't think about it. You got this. <laughs> you got this, Nathan. Your entire existence is not thinking about it. Let's go. I got you. <sighs> See? No big deal. Yeah. Nothing to it. Nothing to it Stay but to me. do it. Give it like 15 years and you'll be making that jump stagnant somehow. It's quite, it's quite unnatural how far Nathan can jump sometimes. Cool, huh? Yeah, totally. Yeah, through here. Right behind you. That might change here though, cause you know, newer generation, the mechanics are probably maybe a little bit more um, realistic. A jump coming up. Okay. Cause didn't he push a boulder one time? Trying to remember. I might be getting him confused okay. with someone else. Right down the middle. Nice ah. and easy. Nice and easy. Oops. Was that a sin? I think that's a sin. Um, not explicitly. You ready, Tarzan? Maybe it is. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Uh. Nice. I was about to say, was he supposed to fall? Hey, up the steeple. Come on. I can't jump that high. Right, just go around the corner. Oh God, please don't break. Please. Mm. I get so much anxiety whenever Nathan climbs. Nice view, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Have like, you ever been up here before? This particular roof? No. But you yeah. do know where you're going, right? Eh, more or less. I know when he falls, he tends to be okay. Are you way here? But still. Can you watch me. Okay. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Easy. Your turn. We can do this type of thing in our sleep. You got this. You got this, Nate. All right, go ahead. Just don't overthink it. Oh crap! Ah. I got you. Come on. Ah. <sighs> I did it. Yeah. Of course you did. Follow me. You know what? Huh? How about you take this one? I've got you, big brother. Really? Yeah, really. I'll follow your lead. Okay, I don't really need to aim. That's good. Whoa! There you go. Okay. You come, okay. I was about to say, you coming or no? Oh, 
All right. After you. Oh, okay. Now, I don't down. know what about that image made me think he was just gonna fall. Just like that, we're out. All right. Check it out. Huh? Whoa, <laughs> you got the 250? 250? What are you talking about? No, this is the 500 cc twin no way yeah where'd you lift it from whoa that's a low blow but hey i'll have you know that i am a changed man bought this with hard-earned cash here come on take a seat what the only time you pull a stunt like this is when you're trying to make up for something hmm you are too smart for your own good you know that all right I got this job. Pays well. Really well. But, uh, I gotta leave town for a little bit. Is it illegal? What's a little bit? Uh, like, uh, a year. At the most, and then I'll be back before you even know it, alright? You're bailing on me. Uh, come on, don't be so dramatic. What, so it wasn't bad enough to leave me in that place? How could you do this to me, Sam? Wait, wait, I'm doing this for you. Mm. The money I make is for the both of us. And then in a couple of years, couple when you're out. Years? <sighs> Take me with you. Well, it's I technically kidnapping, I think. I'll pitch in. I know you think the orphanage sucks. You have no idea. Yeah, but it's the best thing for you right now. All right? You just gotta trust me on that one. It's not fair. Hey. Nothing about our lives has been fair. But we've made it work. Right? Sure. Well, you know, the bike wasn't the only surprise. And I guess I'm gonna have to ruin the next one. What? I found Mom's stuff. Hmm. Everything that Dad sold, I tracked down the buyer. If you're saying this just to make me feel better... Mm -hmm. I swear to God. Where? Yeah. On the other side of town. What do you say we go and get it back? You mean steal it? It's not stealing if it was ours to begin with. I'm pretty sure the cops aren't going to see it that way. Well, then let's not get caught. I'm so curious as to what his mom's stuff is. You ready for this? Hell yeah. Because I assume it's probably something that ignites his interest in Sir Francis Drake. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I forgot about the prison <laughs> thing. <laughs> You're gonna have to do it better than that, pal. Acabemos con esto. All right, amigo. <laughs> I love how impactful Naughty Dog makes their punches feel. Oh, okay, armbar. Nope. Oh, Nathan, come on. A ver cómo te sales de esta. Backhand. Oh, okay. Hey. Come on, this is a one-on-one. Lucha como un hombre. I got you now. Toma esto, pendejo. Come on. No puedes conmigo. Acaba con él. Do I remember how to block? There is a block button, right? Pero yo voy or maybe a I haven't learned it yet. Ahora sí, pendejo. Ya lo tienes. Te vas a arrepentir. Okay, okay, okay. Sí, Gustavo. Te voy a matar, qué mierda. Hey. Te voy a cerrar la bocota, gringo. For me. Come on, Nathan! <laughs> I'm having way too much fun in this prison fight. We weren't fighting? Huh? Right, little guy? <laughs> hey, give me a call when you're tall enough to ride the rides. Solitaria! Cállalo! Too much fun in the prison fight.
Abre. Come on. How long am I supposed to be in here? Huh? Where's the toilet? You looking at it. Have fun. I will. Gracias. <laughs> This is the one scene that made me happy that I at least started this game before playing Uncharted 1 because I remember one of the first conversations Nathan ever had with Elena. He said something along the lines of that, well, I can tell you've never been to a prison in Panama. Get up. <laughs> We've come full circle because now he's in a prison in Panama. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Easy. Ah. All right, that was just unnecessary. I was already going. Yeah, uh, any chance I can take a shower? Cállate. Okay. Morning, boys. Or is it the evening? I'm sorry to tell down here. Oh, idiota. Get up the stairs. Viene saliendo un prisionero. Abran las rejas. Following you, boss man. Hey, nice to see you. <laughs> mm. right. Cold light of day. Ha. Welcome to Panama. Hey, gringo. Bien lo que hiciste a Gustavo. Tengo un cuchillo que tiene tu nombre, amigo. Te lo voy a dar cuando regreses. Déjanoslo a nosotros. Nos encargamos de él. Muévanse. Quítense, cabrones. Hey, hey. Tranquilízate. Looks like you have some fans. Yeah, my adoring public. Abre la reja. Everyone's always grabbing for no reason. Es una sorpresa. Diviértete. I do speak a little Spanish, you know. <laughs> Wait, what, what did you say? You'll find out soon enough. Hi, how you doing today? Nada, amigo. Atrás. De este me encargo yo. Bien. Great, you know, blood stains you got on the wall. It's very decorative. Okay. Where are you taking me anyway? Those are some You'll big see. rats. Oh, wrong way. That's on me. After you. All right, down into the hole. Yeah, this isn't sketchy at all. Hey, you know, this doesn't look like the warden's office. Go left. Left, okay. Yeah, I'm on it. Through there. Through oh. here? Take these cuffs off or what? I want in. In? Whatever you hope to find up there, I want in. <laughs> now, come on, Vargas. The deal was just to get us in and out of here. That's it. Just? I'm sticking my neck out for you, gringos. Yeah, and Rafe is paying you a lot of money for your trouble. See? Si. But not nearly enough. You were told not to open that. Yes. Mm -hmm. I was also told not to take bribes. True. Not to bring anyone here. And not to beat on my inmates. But here we are. Yeah, he's not wrong. Just be careful with that. It's 300 years old. He's kind of reminding me I need to put my glasses Captain on. Henry Avery's crew. You know who that is? He was a pirate. The pirate who pulled off the biggest heist in history and got away with it. I looked him up. It's great. Over Can 400 we? million dollars worth of gold and jewels, all from one single ship. Uh, the guns way. Yeah. yeah, I'm familiar with the story. Can you get to the point? Uh -huh, uh -huh. I occupied the highest cell in the Spaniards' prison. <laughs> Here, I hope someday you will find your way into this infernal place. 
bear my cross and discover the riches of paradise. What? What do you want? The riches of paradise. Oh, it's a metaphor. No, 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 no. <laughs> you and your friends did not pay to get into this infernal place in search of a metaphor. I want in. All right. I tell you what. Let me go up there, check out the prison cell. If there's still anything there after 300 years, we can take this up with Rafe. Now, come on. Letter. Por favor. How are you gonna get up there, anyways? He's gonna climb. climb. Yeah. Oh, unless, of course, you wanna do it, since you want in and all. Just don't break your neck. I don't think that's possible for him, to be honest. Hey, did you bring what I asked? Yeah. Eat it just over there, under the work table, uh, by the crates. All righty. Oh, so this part right here is happening before Uncharted 1, then. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. This was not it. This was not where I was supposed to be going. And you also need to be on the lookout for shinies. Um. Oh. There we go, piece of cake. In my defense, I tried playing this game like back in February, March. I think March. I could be wrong, but was it March? Might have been February. I tried playing this game almost a year ago. OK, my memory is not that sharp. That's not true. My memory is pretty good, but I do forget things. Oh, I wonder if it's already accounting for the collectibles that I picked up the first time I tried playing because that looks like it should be somewhere a collectible is. Let me see something. Okay, it does. Okay, so I was missing some things. Okay. Now we know. Now we know. So this is my chance to find no, stuff that I was missing. All right, this should do the trick. Even though I'm not, um... And there's the prison cell. How do I get up there? I got you, Nathan. I'm not super concerned with... Oh, wait, wait, okay. With finding every little piece Here of treasure. Go. Unless, of course, it's references to other Naughty Dog games. Then I would love to find them. Especially if they're Jack and Daxter related. There you go, buddy. Uh, over the top. I gotta stop letting that get me. It's been getting me for four games now. Well, does it still, this is a rhetorical question. No one answer it. Does this still happen in Lost Legacy? Even though those games are not, or that game is not about Nathan? I assume it does. I, <laughs> Wait till Sam hears about this. I think the things just breaking is an uncharted staple. So I don't think it matters whether or not it's Nathan. <sighs> Onward and upward. So pretty. I always wanted to go to Panama. Oh, my bad. Keep going up. Keep going up, up and onward. Well, I've got to find the highest cell. I'll get us there, buckaroo. These burns had a nice view before he was executed. Oh, that reminds me what I was thinking about during the going this way <sighs> okay let's 
gonna keep happening and I just need to accept that. What I was um, thinking about during the cutscene, which is now we're no real, we're no longer really focused on Sir Francis Drake and his story. Now it's Henry Avery. Okay, this is excessive Uncharted. Hard to believe there were dozens of pirates holed up in here just waiting to be hanged. Okay, where to? Alrighty. I thought the modern prison was bad. I hang the first of Captain Avery's crew this afternoon in full view of the course. A gratuitous act, perhaps, but one that strokes fear in their hearts for what follows. A visit to the remaining men in the tower. The sorry pirates threw themselves at my feet, begging for mercy. One day I hope to hear such pleas from their elusive captain. As I hang the rest of the pirates this morning, one soul was bold enough to offer a bribe as the hood was placed around his head. More vague promises of vast treasure. I asked him where the hoard could be found, and he dropped, uh, then dropped him as soon as he answered. I have no patience for pirate falsehoods. You could have been rich, my guy. You could have been rich. I do need to put my glasses back on. I'm just so lazy. They're literally sitting in front of me. Do I need that? I might need that. Okay, let's do this. I can barely believe this place is still standing. Yes, I do need sure that. Knew how to build a sturdy prison. Okay. Wonder how many pirates died here. Got it. Hey, not gonna lie. <laughs> this is pretty awesome. It is pretty cool, Nathan. Yeah. Sam is missing out. Just gonna keep happening. Can I go all the way around? Okay. Curiosity got the best of me. That's not what the game wants from me. Here we go. Burns his cell. Gotcha. Cell? More like a suite. All right, okay. we got zodiacs. Where to begin? Sun and moon. Alchemy symbols for gold and silver. Wait a sec. Okay, that I did I not know. something like this on the letter. Huh. Well, that's part of the symbol. And flip uh, her over. There's the other half. Now then. Boulder. That's more like it. Okay. okay got a zodiac symbol. Sagittarius. And the Scorpio sign. I knew that on my own. Okay, Sag and Scorpio. Um, so Scorpio is two. Sag is all these squiggles ten. and scratches must mean something. Okay, ten and two. There's two. Ten, ten, ten. I need ten two. Okay. Hmm. Roman numeral ten. Nothing. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to be looking for 12. What did that letter say again? I don't need that. I don't need that. Um, maybe I'm supposed to be looking for 12. I think I just saw 12. This is 12. 10 and 2. X and II. Bam. I understand simple math. Let's get out of here. Come on. <laughs> Gotta watch that first step. Okay. 
Down we go. Huh. Nice one, Nathan. Careful. <clears throat> oh, okay, I see. All right, one more time. I've got it. Yeah, let's see Rafe do that. We're good. We're so good. Ah, there goes my shoulder. <laughs> okay. There's Vargas. I want a cut. I want in. I'll give you in. We're good. We're good. I wasn't scared at all. Nice. Made it. I love the way he climbs now in this talking. one. Like, I know he's been climbing in all the games, but this one's obviously more polished. You made it. What'd you find? Drake? What? The place was picked clean. There's a clue hidden up there somewhere I couldn't find it. You little liar. Are you sure? Were you looking in the right place? Oh, maybe I just I missed something in the letter. There could have been another tower that collapsed centuries ago. Yeah. There uh, any plans to this place? You know, like blueprints? Uh could be. There's a bunch of old files. Okay, great, great. Go, go look through those, okay? See what you can dig up. Meanwhile, I'll, I'll talk to Sam. He's our Avery expert. Maybe he can make sense of this whole mess. Right. I'll, I'll look through the files. Yeah. Turn around. Yeah. My boy's smart. My boy's quick on his feet. Sometimes. Right. Are you done talking to him? Come and find me. You got it. Gringo, if I catch you fighting one more time, one week in the hole for you. Yeah, the hole. So, nice acting, Vargas. Almost as good as mine. Huh? Que puedo decir, eh? Suerte de principiante, ¿verdad? Hijo de puta. Lo siento, chicos. Tengo que irme. Claro, te vas cuando estás ganando. Para ti, ¿eh? Jesus, uh, they worked you off. Okay, you all right? Uh, just another day at the office. Come on. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're not gonna keep me in suspense, are you? You were right. <laughs> no, we were right. No. We just gotta find Rafe. No, and... Rafe. Don't, don't start, please. Oh, come on. Like you said, we did this. You and me. Now this rich asshole comes in on the tail end. How long have we been trying to get in here? We had some leads. No, we didn't. Okay? Not one. So like it or not, no Rafe, no Vargas, and no getting in here. Speaking of Vargas, we got a problem. What kind of problem? Did he let you into the old prison? Here comes yeah, the rich he boy. Did. After he read the letter. Mm. Hmm. So how much does he know? Enough that he wants a cut. Shit. Rafe, if anybody else finds out about this, I'll work it out with Vargas. Don't sweat it. Right now, let's just let's get on to more important matters. All right. Let's find somewhere a little more uh, private. Yeah. All right, coast is clear. Okay. So, what do we got? Huh? Hey. May I? Just be careful, okay? Wood with gold and silver inlay. It's well made. 
It's hollow. <laughs> Why would one of Avery's men go through the trouble of hiding a cheap crucifix? It's not a crucifix. Technically, a crucifix is a representation of Jesus. It's not Jesus. Well, you're right. There's no crown of thorns. He's tied to the cross. Well, if it's not Jesus, then... Read the inscription. Digna factus recipimus. We receive. We receive. We receive the due rewards of our deeds. Yeah. Look at you. There's a benefit of growing up in a Catholic orphanage. That's Saint Dismas. Yeah, penitent thief. But what's the connection? Guys, let's just pretend I skipped all of Sunday school. Uh, okay, Me too. Uh, Please explain. Jesus is placed between two thieves. Okay, one of them mocked Jesus. The other one, this guy was penitent. Okay. And he accepted his punishment with grace. And Jesus brought him to paradise. Penitent thief. Yeah. <laughs> what? You figured it out? There is a cathedral of St. Dismas in Scotland. Fun. And I love Scotland. Avery was in Scotland. That can't be a coincidence. No. <laughs> You know, I had my doubts about you, too, but let's find Vargas. Get the hell out of the shit hole. Oh, hello, Gustavo. Let me guess, this is the guy you picked a fight with? Uh, didn't know he had so many friends. Que no hayamos terminado. Mira, nos ganaste, okay? Muy tarde para hablar. Aquí no sales! You know why? Tú no te metas. Okay. Another prison fight. Oh, okay. Came out swinging. Jeez, did you have to pick on the most popular guy in this joint? Well, I didn't hear you volunteer. Guys, save it for later. Okay, I'm just rolling. Oh, please get off. Nice roundhouse, Nathan. Oh, I'm just I'm just rolling everywhere. Ow. Okay, okay. The double Come team. <laughs> Takes me back to fighting with Charlie at the bar. I miss him. Sam, some help here. Yeah, yeah, please help. Okay. Thanks. Oh, rude? So rude. Oh, I think, is this the main guy? Rude, rude, rude. Come on. Nice. Hey, hey, get off! Oh, uh, where did my brother go? Oh, he's over there. Alguien más necesita que le recuerde las reglas. Alíñense. ¿Qué es esto? ¿Eh? Dame. Are you bringing in contraband, Fergus? Cállate. Who do you think you are? Llévalo a su celda. Trae los gringos a mi oficina. Déjanos. Déjenos. It took you long enough. We almost got killed, you know? No, oh, Rafe. You might. Raph, Rafe. I, I don't know. It's Seriously. one of the two. Oh, I didn't find anything. It must be in a different tower. <laughs> well? It was a good lie, though. What can I say? I was raised Catholic. I always carry one. <laughs> Funny. Hey, 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 look. It's worthless, all right? You think I'm an idiot? Okay, you want to renegotiate? Fine, stop acting like a third world thug. Put the gun away. Thank you. We 
are willing to give you a ten percent. Five. <laughs> Think half. We're doing most of the work. Twenty. And you'd never find it without us. Twenty-five. Equals. Twenty-five. Does that sound fair, guys? Sure. Doesn't mean we have to do it. I suppose I can live with that. Yeah, sure. I mean, 400 million divides nicely by four. Looks like we have a deal. Yes, we have a deal. And if you ever cross me at <laughs> 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 Just made things like ten times harder. We could have backstabbed him later. Mind? You want to find out? Guys, what are we doing here? We're sticking to the plan. Okay. Was this part of the plan? No. Just follow me. Come on. Come on. We didn't actually have to split it with him. Damn it. Rafe, where are we going here? The okay, Rafe. Vargas said the boat is right under the lighthouse. But which way? I don't know. Get outside and figure it out. Shit. Get in! Uh, the window! Oh, Take wait, sorry. Wrong window. Hurry up! There, it's open! You got it! Then go! I don't see the lighthouse. Right now, let's just get away from the guard. Down this way! Through here! It's so smooth! The running is so smooth! Okay, rolls. Rolls the safety. Many safety rolls. You can't get shot if you're rolling. Video game physics. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What's that? No. Wait, what? Oh. Ready? Okay, this is what I was supposed to be doing. Let's go. Yeah, after you. Go, 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 go. You sure? Tell me something. Seriously? Thank you. It's always something. Thank you for coming back. Thanks. clean house. All right, we need to catch up with Ray. Quickly. You thought you trusted him. I do. What point? Oh, do you want to move this or do I move it? We move it together. We're good. He's gonna leave without us, isn't he? Totally. Not if we're quick. Come on. After you. <sighs> They're everywhere. Maybe Just keep going. Okay. Looks clear. God damn it. This place is like a maze. Yeah, it's like they don't want us to leave or something. <laughs> oh, shit. Guard. Hold on, amigo. Right. Good to uh... see you. Break down that ladder for us. <laughs> we're close. There's okay, okay. Like I said, stick to the plan. Yeah, don't celebrate yet. Just gotta follow the rich boy. Right. Yeah, Let's keep searching over there. Find us. There it is. Come on. I don't drop the cross. I oh, hell. On me. Get to the wall. Now. Got it, Nathan. Still got it, Nathan. Sam! Come on! I'll pull you up! I got Come on! Sam, no! No, you hold on! Hold on! Oh, no. Other arm. Uh, uh, no! Sam! 
The Drake family luck does not extend to Sam. We gotta move. Oh no, he's still down there. No, he's gone. Come on, the boat's just beyond the wall. No, no, I can't. I can't. Can't leave him behind. Nate! Your brother is dead. Either come with me or join him. We just have it your way. <laughs> Oh God, no. no. I guess given how traumatizing that would be, it wouldn't explain why Nathan never spoke of his brother throughout the other three games. Meet together. No. Watching fictional characters fall like that because it just gives me anxiety. Oh, okay. That is the beginning of the game, Uncharted for a Thief's End. I have I forgot so much about the scenes of this game, which I guess is a good thing. And I'm thinking a lot of that has to oh there. German ship and Elena. I want to look at his journal. Can I look at the journal like I could in the other games? But um, I'm guessing that I, because this is even a question to myself, because my memory is normally very good, but I'm rationalizing that because I tried starting Uncharted 4 without really knowing Nathan, his character, and his backstory, and really caring about him. A lot of what I tried to do earlier this year kind of went out the window memory-wise, which I guess is a good thing because now I have the background of the other three games, so I can start piecing certain things together. And there are obviously some things that I'm missing, like why we don't, we're not tracking down anything having to do with Sir Francis Drake this time around like I get it this Henry Avery guy had 400 million dollars or the equivalent of dollars but still it seemed like gradually over the courses of the games we stopped being as obsessed with Henry not Henry Avery with Sir Francis Drake Neil Druckmann love to see it and of course the other guy sorry to the other guy you're awesome too 15 years later. I'm very excited to get to Italy because then that will be all new territory and I can really start to understand the story a little bit more. Okay, according to your signal, you're at the coordinates. Can you sign up our hall? No, not yet anyway. You got any pinks from up there? Afraid not. All right, I'll just keep heading downstream. Copy that. Keep me posted. You got it. Older Nathan just hit so hard. Hey, I'm gonna watch you down to a quarter tank. You wanna come up? Nah, I'll be fine. Can't be far. If you don't find it soon, I'm calling it. I'll find okay. Alright. I'm used to PS3 graphics baby face Nathan, and now he has all these wrinkles and worry lines and age marks, and I I personally love it. I'm so excited to see everyone. I want Charlie to come back. Charlie or Cutter was one of my favorite characters. Is that a thing? No. Dang hey, it. Got something here. Thought it was a collectible. No rust, bright color. Maybe it hit the rocks, tore off before tumbling. Hey, you're mumbling. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it looks like a piece of our wreck. Hmm. Must be close by. You're teasing me now, Drake. You're teasing me. So I've missed two collectibles somewhere between here and Italy. Maybe it was more than two, which is fine. Once again, I'm not hyper obsessed with getting all of them. I haven't been, cause that's just a little excessive for a first playthrough in my personal opinion. All right, how's it look? Uh, it's beat up, but intact. Oh, here we go. All right, here we go. <laughs> There. <clears throat> Whoa. <laughs> Morning, fellas. All right, I'm in. 
Well, it looks like a lot of it's still strapped down. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, by my count, we're shy two crates. I'm gonna go round them up. Hold on. How about you come up first, get a fresh tank? Ah, the crate's gotta be nearby. I got this. Ha! Found one. <clears throat> She's a little trapped. Ah, crap. The crate's pinned beneath the trailer. Tell you what, <laughs> secure the other crate right. first. Then we'll lift the trailer up for you. Uh, you see, that's why you get paid the big bucks. <laughs> yeah. I've got her. Ah, found the other crate. One down, one to go. Secure it in the trailer. We're nearly at your position. All right, see you soon. I don't know. I'm smiling because this just feels a lot more rewarding now. So I'm really excited. All right. That's one crate secure. Good timing. We're right above you. Sling's on its way down. My boy has come so far. Coming down. Okay, it's in position. Hook up the trailer. We'll raise it up a bit for you. Can do. Okay, got the cable. I'm gonna try looping it around one of the axles. That should work. Yeah. Oh, wait. I need to physically. Okay. Make the loopies. Oh, yeah, that's one. All right, you watch your oxygen now. That's fine. He hasn't been watching it this whole time. It's okay. And that's two. Okay, trailer secure, ready to go. All right, get clear. We'll lift it up. Ready when you are. And up we go. He did say get clear. I just wasn't listening. Okay, that enough? Yeah, plenty. Just don't drop it on me. <laughs> no promises. Okay, we got the other crate. I'm gonna strap it in with the others. There we go. <clears throat> come on, come on. There you go. All cargo present and accounted for. And with five minutes of oxygen to spare. <laughs> Jesus. Hey, maybe you should hang out then. See if you can find some other treasures down there. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Wanna ride up? <laughs> I love one. Let me know when you're on the sling. Get in there. Okay, I'm in position. Get me out of here, will you? You got it. Going up. Uh -uh. Look at that beauty. How you feeling? Oh, better now that I'm out of that river. I'm gonna stick like fish for a week. <laughs> All right. We're gonna come to you. Hang on. Hang on. What's up, boys? Everything looks so good. Oh, that's where the truck must have gone off. They end up in the river. Oh, that's wild. Hi, friends. Good to have you back, Drake. Yeah, it's good to be back. Toss down your gear. Here you go. Thanks. <laughs> Whoa, this tank's kind of light. I'm just making your job easier, right? By almost Drink. drowning. Oh, gotta I... say that wasn't the slowest dive I've ever sat through. <laughs> Hold on, is that a compliment? Cause I'm stunned. 
Nah, you know what's stunning? Your smell. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I kind of like it. Reminds me of your mom. It's gotcha. That's cold, man. I'm going to tell her you said that, too. Tell her I miss her. Here, uh, I need your signature on this. Everything looks so nice. Okay. Okay. Done. Man, I wish they move all this to computers. <laughs> Government's like 10 years behind the rest of the world, right? Wait a minute. We'll wrap it up as fast as you can. We got shipping. Oh, this isn't right. Let me read this. Let's wrap this up later. My hero. <laughs> Come on, let's go see what you brought us. Let's go check it out. Hey, so how about you let someone else be point man next time? You've earned a break. No, no Let thanks. Away. Take a dive over being at the office any day. Yeah, well, uh, either way, it's gonna be a while to the next dive. What are you talking about? What about Thursday's job? Mm -hmm. Oh, come on, no. Mm -hmm. Got under bid. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, competition's tough. Understandable. Yeah, nah. That is just how it works. Care to do the honors? Yeah, sure. Thanks. Wow. Look at that. What is it? You struck oh. copper. <laughs> well, you'd be surprised how much this stuff is worth. Clients paying good money for the full cover. Sure you don't want to just melt it down, make some pennies? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go celebrate. First round's on me. Bar hopping with you guys? <laughs> no, no, no. Not unless there's hazard pay. Uh, if it's all the same to you, I think I'm just gonna do the paperwork and uh, get home and crash. A rain check, though? All right. Suit yourself. Hey, good work today. Thanks. Copper. Hey, copper's not so bad. It's very conductive. Hey, hey, Nate. Nate, hold on. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, got a present for you. Present? What's this? Got some news from my contact about that wreck off the coast of Malaysia. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the ship's intact. Yeah? Cargo's right for the piggin'. You are mm. a persistent one. I'll give you that. And all the money came through for the equipment, too. We are all set. Except, uh, my best guy. The guy... I trust for the job, the only one. He, he's he got cold feet. My feet were never warm to begin with. And tell me, this contact of yours? He get the permits? No, he did not get the permits. <laughs> he didn't get the damn permits. Of course not. But Nate, don't you see that works in our favor? No permits means no competition. The ship is ours. No permits means no go. Yeah, also break some international Nate, laws, but... This is retirement money for the both of us. I say you okay? do it. I don't know about you, but I don't want to be working salvage when I'm 60. Do you? Sure beats prison. He has been to prison. Listen, I have to pass. And trust me, so should you. Okay, just take it with you. Humor me. I'm okay? not gonna change my mind. Well, then don't hurt to sleep on it. Does it? Say hi to Carla and the kids for me. Okay? All right. No pressure, Nate. But think about it. Man, he has calmed down a lot, though. Younger Nathan would have jumped. You really did your homework on this one. Narrowed down the search area. It would make a hell of a find. Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no way. You are going with the others. How many others do you have? You just have a file box of jobs? I feel like I can finally really appreciate this room. Look at the banners. Climbed your big brother some years back. <laughs> it was not fun. It, it was not fun. There were Yeti, or Yeti-like things. Yee, one of the stranger things I've collected along the years. <laughs> I love it. 
got little jade thing. Some of these look like the actual like little collectibles that we picked up, you know? Oh, that's spray. Let me see this. A Spanish doubloon found in a German U-boat in the middle of a jungle. Who would have thunk? Ah, uh, Sir Francis Drake, all accumulated into a box. Sir Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Let me see this photo. Look at us. Aww. Found this in my old camera. Thought you'd like to have it. The team. Shambhala. <laughs> Miss you, pal. Aw, Tenzin! Nate did make some good friends. So many men killed each other for a piece of this. Aw, you kept some! I leave flammable stuff. Love it. I love it. What's this one? Nah. Wait, what? CM. CM, CM, CM. That's not ringing any bells to me. Yeah. Thanks for nothing, St. Dismas. Oh, okay. This is a box of Sam stuff because that's his jean jacket. But what did CM mean? Yeah. Get a little Nerf gun. Here they come. Take cover. That's <laughs> Bullseye. Let's see, let's see. Gotta get the Yeti. Take that. All right. And that. Be oh, blessed. wait, that one's the bad guy from two. Ah, what was his name? Are you coming down to eat? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah, I'll be right there. <laughs> I want to see my wife. Just, just give me a minute. Gotcha. Okay, I think I've hit most of them. That's cute. Anything else to pick up and look at? Yeah, late time's over. What's this? Not really my style anymore. Oh, his collection of belt buckles. Now this was a crazy ride. Oh yeah, we got drugged and saw some genies. Uh, how's mm. things? I've been up to my usual Not shenanigans. Time, Chloe. Wait, is this? Yeah, Arama the Pillars. Uh, nothing major, but enough to keep the heat on and the wine stocked. Caught wind of something sounded right up your alley. Should you ever change your mind, give me a yell. Always a uh, hand for a quick getaway. Aww. I love Chloe. Happy to be married to Elena, but I do love Chloe. Sir Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Okay, we got Lawrence. So many things. Um, I think that's it for this room. I looked at this, right? Okay, I did. What's that say? Okay, Lost Treasure Crusade. All right, T.O., let's head out. All right, Nathan, I need to take a peek around your house. Is this what you're working on? Okay, travel guide to Bangkok. Wow, 
we really need to go on another vacation. Oh, yes, you guys and do. Tomorrow. All the photos of them being cute. Nepal, I miss you. I don't miss the Yetis, but I do miss you. Anything hiding in the closet? <laughs> oh, wait, okay. Wow. Was this their their wedding that they had between two and three? They got married between two and three. Or is this like a, a recent thing, a more recent thing? Oh, Sully crying in the background. I love it. I do. I love their house. It's so cozy. All the memories, the cool stuff. The artifacts. You were up there a long time. Well, Hi, I was wifey. researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. Oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks. I love them. Okay, grab food. And done. Okay. Oh. Finish it? Yeah. Oh. You know, it's probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? God, I'm starving. Looks good. Mm-hmm. Joe, how was your day? <laughs> what? Huh? Got none of that. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm -hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, some brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck we got <laughs> apparently the natives called it a semi oh. so it, the boring stuff but tell me about the article well it started out as this fluff piece mm -hmm. about tourism in bangkok but i don't think the magazine is going to like the angle that i'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was that it was like shock to the lungs like the second And he's thinking about an adventure. Ah. What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> oh, really? I'm, what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? This one? Bangkok, tourism, smogs. Uh, the lost city of Bangkok. The people love Bangkok. Flights in Bangkok. I mean, it did start with flights in Bangkok, but the people? Uh, the people of, of uh, Bangkok. And, and the smog. And how they, they yeah. can't uh, yep. Yep. They get a flight anywhere. And... People can't breathe. That was close. <laughs> wow. Right, I'm sorry. No, it was valiant. I, I was in the really ballpark, right? That was in the ballpark. In a different state, but yeah, <laughs> you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. She wants us to do the Malaysia job. You know what? I don't want it. Why? Really? 
I mean, he doesn't have the permits. So? And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky, all right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. Let's call Sully. You haven't seen him in Elena, what, two years. Look, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? I appreciate the gesture. It's just. I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Okay. Stop, I'll do them. No, hold you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I clean. It's fine. I mean. At least, at least, uh, let me let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me uh, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? <laughs> yeah, I think you're scared. Now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't TV need to game know what thing. It's called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh. for that. He's not so, wrong. What do you say? Chicken? Is it a bet? He's great at running and jumping. Oh wow. Okay, cowboy. The PS One. Okay. Watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning. All right. Oh, I need to go dig up my old PlayStation 1. I know for a no, fact my parents have load. it. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, okay, okay give it a second. Okay, this was a rough time in our lives. Things took a bit. Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just, uh... How do you, uh... How do you make it go? <laughs> Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay. okay. Oh, oh. So you want to run towards the camera. Okay, okay. okay. Oh, run no, no, no. Camera. My bad. My bad. It's yeah, the it's the things. Down. It's not right. the it's Which not the it? joystick. Right thumb. Okay, run away. In from my the defense, I've Why never played Crash Bandicoot. Me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. Use your spin attack. Got it. Okay, okay, okay. I'm golden. Oh, yeah, way to go there. Not bad, not bad. What is that thing, a fox? Okay. Bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Okay, okay smash okay. the boxes. Uh, oh, wait, I lost fox that. Smashing okay. crates. Bandicoot, and that's just, it's what he does. It's a fox, and it's not very realistic. Okay. I can do it. I can do it. Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. That doesn't look anything like a bandicoot. Have I don't know what a bandicoot is. A bandicoot? Uh, no, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. I always assume uh, the bandicoots were make believe, good. but I guess they okay. can be real things. Okay, 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 okay. I'm I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. I'm getting stressed okay, out for no it. reason. Look at me. I cleared a level. I definitely didn't beat her high score though. I want to go again. I was so close. Can I go again? What? Is that it? I didn't get and enough apples. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Put on a new I game. I want to play Jack and Daxter. Get another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really? really? You gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier. No, just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning you. What are you gonna do? I'm warning you. In real life, what can you do? I'm Show me, what can you I'm do in real you. life? What do you think about that? I love them so much. <laughs> hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Mm. Um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. I've said it before in my other playthroughs of one to three. They are like the only video game couple I have ever cared about. So much paperwork. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <laughs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. 
about your height, <sighs> a little bit leaner, definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all Damn. right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take <laughs> it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Oh. Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patch me up and they... toss me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I... I mean calls I, I checked everywhere I, everything i heard everything i found it, it all confirmed you were dead nathan we killed a guard okay mm. so they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life and i nearly did he's a sam i man if i had known i i, I swear to you i would have come, come back i know nathan i know it's important now though is that i'm out <laughs> <laughs> hey hey you still with me Need some air. <laughs> You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. <laughs> it's a lot to digest, you know? <laughs> but how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, right, right. Slow down. Hey? Have a seat. Okay. I wanna hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. So what's to tell? A lot. Call some of your old contacts. They tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. <sighs> Jeez, what crazy stories? Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah. Yeah. That, uh... There were also that Yeti people. Come on, man. What did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? <laughs> start with the best part. Oh, I feel like we should start from the beginning. We'll start with El Dorado. Okay. Um, uh, do you remember the theory that we had that Sir Francis Drake faked his own death? Yeah, sure. Okay. He did. I found the coffin. Off the coast of Panama? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now, get this. Okay, I open it up, right? right? And there's no body. But Man, Sam has missed bottom. so much. This is old journal. Are you shitting me? I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed. Yep, and, three for uh, three. We made it out alive. Well, technically Barely. two for three, because El Dorado wasn't a city. Unbelievable. Yeah. No, two for two. That's math. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. <laughs> you, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological mm -hmm. gold mine yep. and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. I know, that's what uh, I keep it's saying. It's story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring. The engagement ring. I'm married. <laughs> I can't believe I, Elena from the stories, that's my wife. It took us a while to get to you that part. Tonight, dinner, at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Does the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. oh. Butcher of Panama. Right? Why? Another thing I forgot about. He owes that guy, Same right? Story, but, uh, last year he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. <sighs> well, you're not reading tonight. Sam, you come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> I mean, 
they have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. No. Oh. And when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. What will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has... ...become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Ooh. Given the opportunity? Absolutely. Okay, Sam has talked himself Abisha. into a corner with the drug lord. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? <laughs> the opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segment the key. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel. Are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. D okay. Vamanos. I mean, now we owe a drug lord, but at least he's getting out of prison. Holy shit. Los demás están en posición. En camino. Todo va de acuerdo al plan, señor. Fantastic. How long have you had this plan? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. I'm right you behind to move you. Quickly. Holy shit. Un pedazo de madera la puerta. Nunca saldrás de aquí. Silencio. Jesus. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here. You Thank you. I, I will take it. You remember how to use it. Yeah, it'll come back to me. Like riding a bike. Todas las puertas. Hector, you do that, and we'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly. Háganlo. Stay close, Sammy. Okay. Let's escape prison. Come on. Oh. Right, they're mostly yeah they're taking care of this let me just go oh my god okay the sway on this gun is terrible or maybe I'm terrible probably both Okay, I need to keep you down. Your luck does not last nearly as long as your brother's. Thank you, Hector, Mr. Drug Lord. Come on. You see? The plan's working. Yeah, I see. Oh, okay. I can't just go around that guy. So now what? Estamos en posición. Están listos? Sí. Busquen donde cubrirse. Samuel, get behind something. Don't have to tell me what? twice. Why? Just do it. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, can I have the... Thank you. This is what I wanted. Get back, son of a bitch. 
I do not want to trade guns. Can I? I might have to trade. Samuel, Samuel, take cover. Oh, take cover. All right, here we go again. Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready? Yes. Oh. Okay. okay. Which directions are which? There we go. One more, I think. Oh, he's dead now. Samuel, stay back. Okay. Holy shit. We gotta go, Sam. We have committed to this plan. I mean to get out of undercover. Supposed to wait for No time to catch a Move it. Don't bother with them. Keep Okay, don't bother. I will listen. Next for Samuel Drake. Mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, 
I think a bath. Mm hmm I'm gonna sleep on a real bed. Let me find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Important. Seems like a pretty good start. Yeah. It is. So, uh, how long do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh, Say, like, well, a year, I, two years. Back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? Five years. Don't lowball it's it. It's hard to say until I get started. You said you know where it is. Yeah, uh, I do, okay, but... Listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it. Okay, but I've, I've, I've got some very I I at least. Oh, okay. J just, just wait. Take, take, take. Hey, take it easy. Should have lied. I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I can, I can get it, okay? I, I just need some time. Let me go to you. You see, the problem is, I'm having all these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear. To you. How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. He didn't ask Three for months. enough. Three months is a Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? You could have at least asked for a year. Same. Three months. Half the treasure. Now, if you run or try to hide the treasure, or do something really stupid like go to the authorities, oh no. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. <laughs> Mm. Here. Come on. Now, the nearest town. It's ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. It's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. I don't know. If you want him what to find, find it quickly, you should just give him a ride. Then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. When I swear to Samuel. Bye, Hector. So, Alcazar lets me go, and here we are. This is bad. We just pick up the trail where we left off and... Wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. Mm -hmm. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. The moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? I just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Mm. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever's missing from the one in Panama is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Oh, well, you know it. Uh, yeah. And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? <laughs> yeah. And where are you gonna get the money to outfit all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house and it still wouldn't be enough to Yeah, you're gonna 
Try and steal it, huh? No. We are gonna steal we it. We are. Oh no. No, man, listen, I'm I can't. I'm I'm out. <sighs> what? No, I, I I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Uh, I don't know. Like, uh, anybody, uh, Charlie Cutter. No. No, he's Call like, Charlie. Oh, Charlie. No, absolutely not. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got in that phone. Charlie's a good man, okay? okay? He's a good friend. I understand wanting to work with your brother, though. But don't doubt Charlie Cutter. So there's gotta be another way. Unless it, there's like tight enclosed spaces. Certainly not with Alcazar. So I missed, how much longer do you have? It gave you three months. You made it from Panama to America. Hey, hun, it's me. Yeah, hey. uh, listen, you're not gonna believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but uh, it's like I'm gonna take that Malaysia job after all. A little liar. Okay, I need to end this right here during the cinematic and then I will immediately pick up for the next episode. So first and foremost, I do not like that we are lying to our wife. Largely because everything that we know about Elena as a collective points towards, you know, she would probably be okay with this. If not, she would be at least understanding as to why Nathan feels like he has to go into the situation to help Sam. So I don't like that we're lying to Elena. It feels very unnecessary and like it's going to cause unnecessary drama later on down the road. But overall, I am very happy that I have picked this back up, especially after finally I've played one through three, because so many things just hit so much harder emotionally, having seen where Nathan started and where he has ended up now. From seeing Nathan older, where he has wrinkles and a little bit of gray hair, and he's obviously a very weathered individual. And his personality, I wouldn't say his personality is different, but his motivations are different. He's less likely to jump into something head first. At least that's what it seemed like when he didn't really want to take the Malaysia job because they didn't have the permits. But now with his brother back in the picture and he probably feels like he does owe his brother something because that's his brother. And Nathan has been off for the past 15 years having these amazing adventures while Sam has been stuck in prison. So he definitely feels like he owes his brother, but from seeing Nathan older to seeing Nathan with Elena and seeing the home that they built and the memories that they have to hearing the names and seeing photos of old friends like Tenzin and Charlie and Chloe and Sully, who I'm very excited to see. Everything hits a lot harder having played the previous games. There's still some timing things that I'm a little bit confused about because obviously Nathan grew up in the Catholic orphanage and he looks about around the right age that he looked when he went to South America and first met Sully. So I am wondering what the time difference is there. And also how Nathan ended up in South America on his own without Sam hanging out with Sully. And then years later, he's in the Panama prison with Sam. There's like some timeline things that I don't know if they ever get answered. I guess it's not too important. It just makes me wonder a little bit, but I do really love the story. And like I said before, it kind of benefits me in a way that because I wasn't invested the first time I tried to start this game, nothing really stuck in my memory, which I count that to be a good thing because now I can kind of look at the story that's going on here in Thieves End with new, or at least fresh eyes, not new eyes, but fresh eyes. And I'm very excited to be in Italy, the Rossi estate, because we're getting very close to just new ground for me, which I'm super excited for because I am very invested in how Nathan's story is going to end. And I do know that there is the other game, Lost Legacy, but that seems to be more focused on Chloe because I do remember when that trailer dropped years ago and Chloe was the centerpiece of that. 
which I'm excited for because I love Chloe. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to see where the story goes, how things end, and just see the conclusion of what truly has been an epic journey. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this first episode and I hope you join me again and I'll be seeing you very soon. Bye now.